Hey, Chiefs Kingdom. Happy Victory Tuesday. I'm Haley Lewis, and welcome to Asterix Chiefs News Daily Asterix. After a thrilling overtime win, the Kansas City Chiefs remain undefeated this season and have extended their winning streak to an impressive 14 games, dating back to last season's New Year's Eve showdown. Before we dive in, remember to Asterix like and subscribe Asterix right here on the KCSN YouTube channel for all the latest Chiefs news. Now, let's break down last night's win against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Game recap. Monday night football in the rain, Kansas City was back at Arrowhead, taking on the 4-4 Bucks in what turned out to be a back-and-forth battle. Tampa Bay won the coin toss and chose to defer, giving Patrick Mahomes and the Chief Defense the first crack at scoring. The night started with drama as Tampa Bay gathered on the Chiefs' midfield logo before introductions talk about bold. On the opening drive, rookie Xavier Worthy nearly hauled in a deep pass, only to step out of bounds. After a sack, the Chiefs had to punt. The Bucks' offense took the field, and while Justin Reed nearly snagged an interception, both teams ultimately punted on their first drives. The Chiefs got on the board with a 40-yard field goal from Harrison Butker to go up 3-0. However, Tampa Bay responded with a touchdown, taking a 7-3 lead. Mahomes and the Chiefs answered, connecting with DeAndre Hopkins for his first touchdown as a Chief, putting KC up 10-7 at halftime. Second half showdown the third quarter saw Tampa regain momentum, taking a 17-10 lead. But in the fourth, Mahomes found Sam Perini in the end zone to tie it up at 17-17, despite tweaking his ankle on the play. Mahomes' resilience shone as he stayed in the game, and later he connected with Hopkins for his second TD of the night, putting KC up 24-17. With seconds left in regulation, Tampa scored to tie the game at 24, forcing overtime. In OT, the Chiefs won the toss and drove effortlessly downfield, thanks to key plays by Kels, Hopkins, and Kareem Hunt, who capped off the drive with a walk-off two-yard touchdown for the 30-24 victory. Several Chiefs players were banged up during the game. McCole Hardman, shoulder, returned after an early injury. Defensive lineman George Karlaftis and Turk Wharton also left briefly, but later returned. Mahomes' ankle injury raised concerns but he powered through, assuring fans he'll be ready for next week. Rookie T. Jared W.I. tore his ACL in practice on Friday and will be out for the season. In response, the Chiefs signed Peyton Hendershot to the active roster and added Anthony Ferkser to the practice squad. It's also Asterix trade deadline day Asterix, but Kansas City opted to stay put with no last-minute moves before the 3P.M. Central Deadline. We'll keep an eye out for any late reported trades, but for now, it looks like the Chiefs are content with their roster as they gear up for the second half of the season. Thanks for tuning in to Asterix Chiefs News Daily Asterix. Make sure to hit that Asterix Like Asterix button, Asterix Subscribe Asterix, and we'll see you right here tomorrow for more Chiefs updates. Have a great Victory Tuesday, Chiefs Kingdom.